Hey, I'm KK, and today I want to talk to you about something kind of heavy. I want to talk a little bit about changing directions in your business. Look, I've heard from so many boutique business owners that it's been a struggle. You've basically either created a brand new business overnight, or you've been struggling to find your niche and how to make this work for you, whether it's going online, offering more unique services, or anything in between. I think changing directions is a really important part of being an entrepreneur and uh, doing this for as long as I have, I've definitely been known to pivot a time or two. I think what's missing from our industry right now beyond resilience, because I think everyone's doing the best that they can, is a true understanding of their clients' needs. So there's something to be said about having built a community based on a specific service or even a product type. But what I think is often overlooked is the opportunity to take that exact same client base and convert them into something bigger, convert them into a real community that trusts you for way beyond just the first service that they met you at, or even the fact that they've been doing the same thing with you for some time. And I think that's where as business owners, it can be quite scary. You know, change is something we all know that is coming at some time and are never fully prepared for, at least we don't feel that way. And I actually believe that change is one of the very best things that your business needs. In fact, to be honest, I've said this a lot and I'll say it again. We are an industry based on hype and copycats. And I'm actually thinking that it's time for a change. I think it's time for us to be more unique. We are more alike than we are different right now. And I think that's some of the best parts of our industry. But I also believe that in order to get to the next level in your business, oftentimes it really takes focusing on where you're uniquely excellent. So not where you're like your neighbor or where there are 17 businesses like you in a market demo, but instead it's where can you serve your current community best? And sometimes that means it's time to innovate. And I think that's where we are now. I know that the typical response to innovation is that costs a lot of money. I don't have that kind of time. I have to look at the day to day and I cannot focus on the big picture. Those are the three areas of pushback that I would hear from any business owner who's not laser focused on growth. That's the honest truth. If you're not laser focused on growth, then you won't find the time, you won't find the money, and you certainly won't have the resources to invest in your business so you can pivot, so you can future-proof your business. And I think that's what we need right now as an industry. So whether you own a boutique fitness studio, maybe you're an online content creator, Maybe you own a spa or salon. It doesn't matter the wellness business that you've created. What matters is where you're willing to spin to next, where you're willing to pivot into, because that's where you've got a lot of influence. And honestly, you haven't used it to your benefit. So utilizing your influence means that you take the things that you know you've done well and the community you've built around that, and you've essentially created a funnel a funnel of people who trust you, who know you, and you provide them like-minded services, like-minded products, things that actually edify their outcomes and their lives, because that's why they turn to you. That's why they chose your business. And I think there's something really powerful about that. If we can look past the lack of resources, time, or future thinking, and instead think about the evolution of your client, because hey, clients change. Our business is fully based on retention, and yet we don't realize that part of great retention is evolving with our clients. That's where I believe I'm best suited to talk to you about this. I have clients of all stages, all ages, and honestly, all aspects of the industry. And the clients that I see do best, the clients that I really can push to the next level are resilient, of course, but they're also innovative. They're also willing to try new things. They're willing to invest. They've been smart with their finances and they're ready to do what their community needs, even if it's something they don't have in their current arsenal right now. And that can be you too. So I want to encourage you today, really start to think about what changing directions can mean for you personally, for your business, and of course, for the future of the industry, which is rapidly changing and looking for you to come on and change with it. Let me know where you're stuck. I offer a complimentary business analysis and plan so I can create something that's custom to you and ready to take you to the next level. See you soon.